speaking of new trailers, a brand new spot for the upcoming Anne Hathaway Robert De Niro film, The Intern, has arrived. Ben Whitaker, Robert De Niro, is a 70-year-old widower who has discovered that retirement isn't all it's cracked up to be. Seizing an opportunity to get back in the game, he becomes a senior intern at an online fashion site. Mark Byers saw the new trailer for The Intern. I buy it. I'm really interested to talk to Schnepp about this because <laughs> Schnepp had some very, at our pre-show <laughs> meeting, Schnepp was very uh, fervent in his opinion about this trailer. I certainly For me was. personally, I felt like it was pretty much the same beats as the first one. It was. It took itself a little more seriously. It wasn't as uh, humor-based <laughs> as the first one, but I, I liked seeing De Niro in there. I think it's going to be a good role for him. He looks like he really commits to this. He's not mailing this role in. Him and Anne Hathaway seem to have a fun dynamic. I like the Renee Russo is in it. I think yes. she's going to be fantastic in it. Yes. Adam Devine is hilarious. Seeing him interact with De Niro is going to be funny. And the way that De Niro interacts with the other males in the office seems like it could be a good source of comedy. So we got more in this than we got in the Zoolander teaser. And uh, <laughs> I, I think this movie is going to be a pleasant surprise. Schnepp. I, well, we were, me and Ellis were talking. I was like, you know what? I did not like the first trailer for the intern. It felt like that Google intern, goofy, like slapstick kind of ah, bullshitty okay. kind of uh, those kind of comedies that I absolutely hate. And so I was like, ah, I'm not going to see this. I don't care if De Niro's in it. It looks like garbage to me. And then this trailer, I, I bought into it. They just subtly changed the trailer enough and showed just enough more story points, more human elements. Tonally, it feels different and enough where I'm like, all right, I'm, I am buying into this. I do want to see this film now because of Robert De Niro's performance and that he wants. He's just like, look, I want to try something different. And I'm, I, I'm old enough where it's, it's it, this trailer felt like how you should treat older people. You should treat them with respect and they have something to add. They have value. And that's what I think this movie's going to show. So What I really liked about it, and what I liked about the other one, too, because for me it's a buy, I, I did enjoy this trailer quite a bit, is that unlike, say, you're right, when you read it on paper, this film feels like it could be in danger of being what that Vince Vaughn, Owen totally. Wilson, Google internship. I can't even remember the name of that movie. The was. internship. It was the internship. Yeah. You know, it could be like that where it's like the ridiculousness of these guys who have no idea about this new world and trying to understand the new world. When I watch this trailer and the original trailer as well, what it feels to me is like the filmmakers are turning that around and saying, this is a guy who's bringing the older, more solid values, if you will, into the new environment mm -hmm. that this new environment tends to be making. What I loved about the first trailer and that they carried over to the second one, it almost is like, especially that one scene in this trailer where Anne Hathaway, Robert De Niro, Adam Devine, the other guys are in there, and like Anne Hathaway goes, what has happened that in one generation, men have gone for from Harrison Ford, Robert De Niro, uh, I think she was Jack Nicholson to this and a bunch of slobby guys, uh, you know, whatever. And it's true. And I was listening to Robert De Niro talk about this is that not in terms of machismo. People think you're talking about how men have forgotten how to be men. He thinks you're talking about machismo or something. He goes, no, no, no that's it. It's, uh, there's a, a dignity. There's a class that you want to bring that, that re regardless of what background you come from, whatever, you carry yourself as a man, you know, the sort of thing. And and I love that they kind of want to introduce that into this. I think Robert De Niro is going to do this brilliantly. I love, I think the, Anne Hathaway is the right person to do that against. Mm -hmm. I think there's two terrific performers. And you're right. I watch this because you never know with Robert De Niro these days. If he's gonna if he's gonna mail it in, right. or if he's gonna give you a um, silver linings playbook kind of performance, like which one are we gonna get? This one seems like one he has some passion for, and I liked it. I am so glad I bought this trailer because you guys just made two of the best sales pitches I have ever heard on this show to see a movie. All of a sudden, this movie is now like The Force Awakens. Like we need to go see this movie. I'm excited for this. <laughs>